Hello students, we were in chapter 4, the economy of Maharashtra. In the last class, we studied about the introduction, administrative division, important features of the economy of Maharashtra, economic development of Maharashtra, measures taken by government for the agriculture development, etc. Today, we are going to study the industry of Maharashtra. Maharashtra is an industrially advanced state. Industrial sector play an important role in the economic development of Maharashtra. It has the potential to absorb excess labor from framing sector. It leads to diversification of market, generate higher income and higher productivity. As per annual survey of industries ASI 2016-17, the industrial sector of Maharashtra is at top position. The share of the industries in net value added NVA is about 18%. Maharashtra has also been the first choice of domestic and foreign investors. So, when we study about the industrial advance of Maharashtra, we know that Maharashtra is in India, Maharashtra has uh, generated the higher productivity in the sector of industries and even uh, shared a lot of employment in the industrial sector for all over the country. When we study about the foreign direct investment FDI, in the earlier 1990s, the government of India started amending the norms capping foreign direct investment in certain sector. We know the new industrial policy of 1991. Accordingly, new industrial policies and FDA was given a lot of scope in the country. The Liberalization Act of 1991 cleared the path of FDI. Maharashtra has been consistently ranked as the number one investment destination in India. The state has remained in the forefront in the terms of FDI in flow in the country. The FDI inflow in Maharashtra since April 2000 till September 2017 was 6,11,760 crores with 31% of total FDI inflow at all India level. So, the industrial sector has been developed to a very high position uh, in the matter of Maharashtra. Now, what is the problems faced by the industrial sector in Maharashtra? We discuss about the different aspects of industries in Maharashtra, but there are many problems that the country is facing in the matter of industries. So, when we discuss that problem, the first one is delay in government procedure. The government procedure is delaying for taking many decisions in the matter of industrial development. Due to this reason, the industrial sector has been lacking a lot in the case of Maharashtra. The second point, lack of opportunities for skill development. The skill development has means having a lack of opportunities in the sector of Mara, uh, industrial sector. So, the when we discuss about the industrial measures by the government, we can see that there is this uh, opportunity for the skill development is not that much to up to date in the case. So, this is a great problem when we discuss about the matters of Maharashtra. The third one, lack of updated technology. The technological advancement is lacking. It is due to the lack of, we have discussed that the investment it is very good in the case of Maharashtra, but the technological updation is seeing a great problem. Next, it is lack of infrastructure facilities. In the matter of roads and many other uh, infrastructure process, there is a great problem in the state of Maharashtra. We can see in uh, when we study about uh, the policies in details. Next, it is lack of motivation to new entrepreneurs. Means 
many of the industries are sick industries this is due to the lack of motivation so it is very essential to motivate the entrepreneurs to take over the industries and uh, to develop in a great manner next lack of development programs regional imbalance when we study about the regional imbalance we can understand that some of the districts having more industries and some don't have so these type of problems the people have uh, means forced to go migrate from villages and many other districts to some other districts for the search of job so this imbalance is a great problem for the development now what measures are taken by the government for the industrial development the, according to the economic survey of maharashtra in 2017 18 some of the points has been noted that what measures has been taken place for the development of industrial sector first one single uh, window cell was initiated to provide all clearance for existing the pro, uh, pro, uh, prospective investors so the uh, the government has given opportunities to go and approach with their problem and solve their problems second maharashtra industry trade and investment facilities cell that is maitri was introduced to provide online consolidation information about the investment process though there are many shortcomings while the investors or the persons who are taking uh, the production process the maitri has uh, played an important role for uh, overcoming the difficulties of this sector third awards for export performance space and subsidies are provided to small scale industries to encourage participation in international exhibitions so the government has been made many efforts to bring forth the medium small or uh, large industries to participate in the international exhibition as to develop their skill even though when we talking about the industrial sector to today we are facing many problems lack of jobs lack of jobs in industrial sector the initiatives many of the industries are shut down these all problems are there even though the governments are taking a lot of measures to uh, bring forth these problems creation of special economic zone says to the boost the industrial growth was established by the government to solve the industrial problem maharashtra state industrial cluster development program msi cdp is being implemented all over the state to develop the small medium and micro entrepreneurs so in maharashtra this point we have to just keep in mind that what measures are taken by the government to overcome all these difficulties the single window cell was initiated industrial trade and investment fac fac uh, facilitation cell that is maitri was established to solve the problem and all other problems were just taken into consideration and the government is trying the level best to solve this problem even though it is not uh, taken to the 100% success its uh, the work is going on next service sector the service sector of maharashtra which what what all it comes under the service sector in the service sector we can see the insurance tourism retail banking education social service service sector includes provisions of services to business as well as final consumers service sector is the largest employment generating and fastest growing sector in the economy the contribution of service sector to the gross state domestic product that is dsdp has been highest compared to the other sector in the economy it was 54.5% during 2017 18 the core area of development of service sector includes fintech it ites startups cloud computing electric vehicle defense tourism private universities government has also tried to expand the service sector by various activities in tier 2 cities so different measures were taken for, by the government to improve the service sector core areas of service sector we can see the core areas of service sector classification of uh, infrastructure that is economic infrastructure and social infrastructure now 
what all infrastructures has been created by the government to develop that is one is economic and social in economic it comes energy transport communication health in, in social it comes health and education economic infrastructure what is economic infrastructure it facilitates production and distribution of goods and services for economic development and social infrastructure means what it is for the social well being of human life different policies are put forward by the government means what all what all can it come the infrastructure includes that is literacy program educational public health housing drinking water and sanitation this all things comes under the uh, this social infrastructure now measures taken to develop social infrastructure education is considered as one of the basic human needs it forms the backbone of socio economic development of any country education is significant aspects of human resource development hrd the state of maharashtra has implemented various educational scheme to achieve the goal of education there are four level programs that is primary secondary and higher uh, secondary higher education so these four sectors uh, means in the educational policies the government are taken uh more efforts uh to bring forth the uh, difficulties in this field when we say about the primary sector the state of maharashtra has implemented the right to education that is rte of children in the age group of 6 to 14 years to provide free and compulsory education under sarva shiksha abhiyan ssa the expenditure of the state government on primary education was rupees 19486 crore during the uh, 2016-17 we can uh, means just uh, when we take the textbook just go you can you have to go the primary education first to eight education installment uh, that is institutions and en- enrollment uh, in the year 2016 the number of school was 1 lakh 4971 and total enrollment for the school was One thousand five hundred fifty. Ah, one lakh fifty nine thousand eighty six. In that number of teachers, five point thirty, and uh, that is uh, pupil ratio is thirty is to one. In this way, the government is taking important measures for the improvement of education in the different sectors. When we study about the secondary sectors, secondary uh, sec- section, secondary and higher secondary. Rashtriya Madhyamik Shiksha Abhiyan (RMSA) was launched in 2009 with the objective to improve access as well as quality education during 2016-17. The state government expenditure on secondary and higher secondary education was 16,089 crores. Okay, in the higher secondary education, we can see the government of Maharashtra is taking very great opportunity for the higher education. higher education helps in creating technical and skilled human resources which is an important input necessary for overall development there are 22 state universities out of which four universities are for agriculture one university for health science course one for veterinary science one for technology and 15 other universities for general courses in addition to their 21 autonomous universities one central university four private universities five institutes of national importance in the state to meet the challenge of liberalization privatization and globalization the state was enacted new maharashtra public university act in 2016 so the key focus of this act is to promote academic autonomy and excellent skill based education through democratic process in higher education Maharashtra is also first state in the country to receive rusa grant that is research innovation and quality improvement for the setting the innovation of technological transfer hub rusa means rashtriya uchchatar shiksha abhiyan it is centrally sponsor schemed by the government in 2013 2013 that scheme was put forth and it was uh, just uh, supported by the central government for the development of the uh, education sector in other sector 
the girls education was given importance adult literacy then uh, technical education tribal education all these were given importance in the matter of uh, maharashtra when we take the health service there were 18 uh 1814 primary health centers in the country the government of maharashtra emphasized on the pro programs to strengthen the health system in the rural and urban area when we come in the matter of tourism maharashtra attracts many tourists from different state and abroad too to promote the state as leading tourist destination the government has formulated maharashtra tourism policy in 2016 and the objective of this policy is to make the maharashtra a leading tourist destination by 2025 to attract investment to the tune of 30 crore 30000 crores to create 1 million additional job in the industrial sector hospitality was one of the uh, means um, part of the government to develop the hospitality is much broader industry than other industries it has grown manifold in maharashtra due to the flourishing tourism one of the most defining aspects of this industry is that focus on customer consumer satisfaction hotel industries is one of the sector of the hospitality industries many forms of transportation and catering to the tourism are also part of the business example airline mumbai goa cruise ship fancier trains deck and odyssey restaurants general tourism and even management are also a part of this sector in maharashtra the entertainment industries has achieved the worldwide recognition india produces the largest number of film industries in the world and maharashtra played the remarkable role in this entertainment industries uh, sector that is maharashtra generate employment opportunity to large number of people Kolhapur has been a worth mentioning city for regional films. Mumbai popularly known as Bollywood has great importance in the matter of this development. Bollywood has a great impact in the global uh, film industries. Cooperative movement Maharashtra cooperative movement is the state to the country also. So the cooperative movements when we say the cooperative movements of the country when we say we can say that uh, it is an effective instrument in the economic development of rural areas and improving socio economic conditions of underlying privileges in maharashtra the basic nature of cooperative societies is to encourage the value of self help democratic equality and solidarity cooperative movements in the uh cooperative movements uh, in the state of uh, maharashtra sectors have extended to other sectors such as agro processing agro marketing sugar cooperation fishery cooperative societies cooperative dairy societies etc so these are the different sectors that we have go to uh, we discuss in this uh, lesson students just go through the textbook and uh, we can see that uh, different developmental programs by the state of maharashtra the economy of maharashtra achieved during the industry service sector health sectors and all that education and uh, all the sectors just go to the lesson thank you